It seems like there's uh, some boat exploration, a lot of crafting, survival, building, everything we're looking for in a game. This is single player though, it's not multiplayer, so I don't really know what to expect. Oh God. Oh God. Good thing everybody was writing their last will and testaments. Survive the shipwreck, new goal. Oh shit. Uh, ow. Take the grotto plan. Grotto plan acquired. Uh, get items from the chest. Will do. Move, right click, move all. Is this all my image? I'm so confused. I can take two items I have to choose? Oh God. Jump through the window. Time to swim. What's going on guys? Welcome to the edited version of yesterday's live stream. If you obviously want to see the whole thing, there will be a link down below. Otherwise, just check back every day for an edited version of yesterday's live stream. Subscribe new here, hit the notification icon, and of course, like the video. I will see you in it. All right, is there anything else that washed up? We can cut this down. Okay, so we're, we're getting a little bit of a, like a long dark vibe because this is going to like take time, right? Durability, chances of injury, that type of thing. Craft coconut water. There we go. Coconut water has been acquired. Drink coconut water. Drink. Satisfying hunger. Okay, we can just grab yellow. We can just grab leaves and stuff. Hello, mighty foe. Come here. Nope, he doesn't want to die. Find a shell. Like a seashell? There's some shells. I'll take that. And that. Extract the mollusk from the shell. Ow. Crafting? There we go. It takes 10 minutes to extract a mollusk. A place to sleep. All right. Five narrow leaves. Can do. Look at this area. Do we have a map? Start mapping process to find... Oh, so we have to map? Can I just... Interaction. No tool needed. Yeah, I want these. No, not those. I don't want the dry stuff. I just want the green stuff. Nice. Build a primitive bed. Got a whole bunch of stuff. Building primitive bed. All right, we're going to put this in the shade, obviously. And then we need to build it, which takes time. Hmm. The system's cool. I like it. But maybe we're going to end up, like, running out of time and food and stuff, obviously. New goal, go to sleep. We're just going to sleep right away. I need to eat something a little bit first. Maybe we get a couple more coconuts. I unlocked a new blueprint. Ripe coconut studied. Okay, so as we find things, we're going to unlock new stuff. I'm just going to gather a little bit of things. I'm not going to sleep yet. I'm going to make sure our food and water is up there before we sleep. Come here, Crabbo. Crabbo Dabbo. Come here. He's going to get stuck eventually, right? Nice. You oinked him. Come here, Crabbo. I stabbo. No, we're out of stamina. There's a box over here. I wonder if we can get anything out of the boxes or we have to break them down just for the wood. Nope. See? An apple. A massive stone. Look how slow I'm moving now that I have a massive stone on me. Just dragging around my massive stone. We'll drop that for now. Can we catch up to Crabbo? Stabbo. Stabbo Crabbo. They're so fast. They're like equal. We are equals Crabbo. Not this one though. Eh, shit. The weather affects your health. You gain a status that affects your condition. Hmm. Okay. A little bit of green hell vibe in there. Um. So it wants me to sleep six hours, but like I'm not going to do that yet. We get a peep of the land first. Oop. There is fall damage. I can see why they said this fountain of youth was here. Cause look how stunning this island looks. If this is the fountain of youth island, we might have washed up on the wrong shore. There's like a an obelisk right there of some kind. My guy cannot jump worth a damn. I tell you that. <gasps> why am I climbing? Why am I climbing things? I have a cut. It says. There's so many things. Statuses. There we go. Minor cut. 
Take medicine, eat, drink, and sleep. Equip. Chance recovery, 30% chance of worsening, 28. How do we take medicine? A steamed leaf bandage. I haven't found a wide leaf yet to be able to do that. Uh-oh. Near death? Take medicine? Living water? Sunburn? Take medicine? I have a mild... Oh, God. There's like a momentum to running. I'm just gonna nap. Maybe the cut will clear itself up. I should have slept when it told me to. Uh, it wants us to sleep six hours, so we'll do that. All right, let's see if it fixes our issues by sleeping. Vivacity, we still have a minor cut and a minor sunburn. We had a near-death experience. Okay, that's why we have the max health, right? Stay near the fire, chance of injury, 20%. So we can... There's a higher chance of getting injured in the dark. Hmm, okay. Let's find a stone. Let's go see if we can craft that large stone into a small stone. Grab that crafting. Make that into other items, stones. Boop. We made a stone. Craft a stone axe. Stone axe, one hour to do that. Stone axe completed. All right, do we have like a hot bar? Yes. So one, two, three, four, five, and two is the axe. But how do we harvest a long stick? Just by chopping it, maybe? Let's see. G to cut down. Oh. Is there like a thinner something we could chop down, maybe? Something a little less strenuous? Probably not. All right, let's cut it down. We want to keep this, obviously, for the shade, the big one. Look how easy that is. Put on your shoulder and drop. Okay. We're collecting some stuff. This is where we fell off the rock. I found a stick, but it's a small stick. I need a long stick. Cut down for a long stick. Boop. Disease is worsening. Normal wound. Sleep quality down. Take medicine. We can't make medicine yet. Did I get the stick, though? Craft a wooden spear. Oh, no. We only have one and two right now. Okay. We'll lose the knife for a sec. Bap, bap, bap. Sneak to a crab. I've already killed crabs. I didn't need a spear for that. This is cool so far, though, man. I'm already kind of enjoying this. Seems like there's already a lot to this game. Well, there is sneaking, so I guess I will actually sneak up to the crab like the game told me to. Let's see. Okay. That crab is zooting. I'm here, Crabbo. Get the stabbo. He's never gonna see me coming. I'm on the crab hunt. Throw a spear and hit the crab? Whoa, look at that. Is the crab gone? Like, long gone? I can't see the crab. Oh, we got it anyway, though. We're professionals. Didn't count for some reason. It's like, oh my god, you're too good. Where's there more crabos? There's one. Okay. <sighs> you know? Throwing spears is not my forte. Wingardium Leviosa. Let's throw this. Here we go, here we go. This is the one, this is the one, this is the one. Nice. We did it. Grab that. Grab the spear. Huge. Build a campfire. All right. Maybe we'll get closer to the point where we can actually build a, a bandage. I would like that. But this is our this is our little home right now, so let's make a campfire. Place that. Chance of injury, 1%, but I'm already injured, so there's a higher chance of it happening. There we go. Campfire made. Craft a spindle fire starter. We have flint, though. Why do we need to do that? Okay, spindle fire starter. We need two sticks. Ooh, look at the, the sun coming through, man. Maybe there's worse places to get stranded on, you know? I found one up here before. Maybe these little trees? That's for a log. Or we could do E to interact and we get just two sticks. That's all I need. I'll just take what I need for right now. Okay, and then crafting spindle fire starter. There we go. Have a good feast. Nice. Harvest two wide leaves. I can do that. Are these wide? Okay, so this is actually getting us to do bandages now. Where do we find wide leaves? Hmm. Oh, there we go. Nice. I'm getting sunburned too all the while, so we have to be real careful. I hope we can craft like an umbrella that I can walk around with or something. <laughs> We're just going to get both of them. Five new blueprints were unlocked. All right, I do need bandages. Leaf hat, leaf hat, leaf hat. Yes, yes, yes. 
We need that to block ourselves from the sun. Sun protection, 25%. All right, we need all of these leaves. Give me all of these. We're a little overweight from the leaves. But that's fine. You see the sun exposure top left. We're about to get another sunburn, so I really need to get myself into the shade. We're going to fight animals. We're going to fight the sun. We're going to fight all around survival. It's going to be wild. Just keep running, running, and running, running. Now, steamed leaf bandage. Normal wound disappeared. Statuses. By the fire. So we have cold protection, a bunch of defenses. Wound cannot get worse. Health is recovering. Sunburn. It looks like we need tobacco leaves to fix our sunburn. Okay, so real quick. A leaf cape. A portable box. Increases by 10 carry weight, so that's why we don't grab the backpack, clearly. There's a smoke signal, so we can maybe get rescued. Use to mark a location. Oh, look at all the crafting, man. So we just break down stuff into resources down here. Do sea salt, a builder toolkit. There's a lot going on. All right, we need to find a rope. But like I said, I want to make some armor. Let's do some sandals. Here we go. 25%. So we're looking to get 100% sun protection, obviously. Brave the sun for a second. <laughs> there was three ships on the expedition. I wonder if there's other crashes around the island, maybe. Also getting a bit thirsty. I wonder how water drinking is going to go. Let's get another crabbo. Throwing level one. What? Concentration. Cost one PP. There's full skill trees. So throwing. Increased aiming speed is what we just got. And this is uh, where we do stuff to earn PP. So make a palm juice collector. Make a coconut rain collector. Make flint. So this is where we, yeah, this is where we get all our PP. And then when we get PP, we can go up in concentration. Special objects, weapons, ammo, and drop bags are highlighted. Resist disease, resist poisons, resist control, resist hunger, better sleep, learning. Wow. Okay. So there'll be like builds and stuff of your character. I'm liking what I'm seeing. I'm sniffing what they're farting. I'm really enjoying this already. Let's go. Craft a mapping charcoal is our next objective, by the way. But obviously, we're not going to do that quite yet. I'm assuming coconuts give us a bit of water. We can cook a couple of crabs just to bring with us real quick fire's not lit anymore. Do I want to use the health of my flint right now? I think I'm good. All right, let's go look for more of those leaves so we can get a full sunblock armor. Let's kind of work ourselves from shady tree to shady tree. Tobacco! We needed this. Select all harvest. Ooh, what's that plant right there? Find a cartographer tree. This looks like a cartographer tree. I'm hearing animals. Oh, these are wide leaves. Nice. We need a lot of these. Animal is hunting. You cannot do that. Uh-oh. We're going to back off. Let's go find some shade this way. The thing that's hunting me is right there. What is it? Ew. Hmm. I hear chickens over here. I want to kill those. Come here, little chickadee. Fuck. So obviously, I think the accuracy will increase on this as we get more proficient with it. All right, it is nighttime. Let's head home. My guy is getting pretty tired. Let's have a schmeal. Let's make the charcoal. Fire starting level one. Huge. Make a couple of roasted crabs. Steam compress, and we might as well make another bandage just to have on us. So we're going to use that compress. We're chilling. Nice. Let's eat one of those before we sleep. So nighttime is the red. Daytime is the blue. So we want to wake up just before daytime. Six hours. There's a chicken on my beach. Breakfast. Give me a little chickadee. <clears throat> yes. Right in the keister. My hands are all bloody. wonder if I have a chance of, like, poisoning myself or something. Okay. We have a bit of we have a bit of crab to satiate ourselves right now. We don't have any coconuts. Let me grab a couple of coconuts, because that's our source of water right now. Nice inventory, and then boop, we have water. Nice. Okay, craft mapping charcoal. Mapping charcoal. We need small sticks. Okay, let's get a couple of small sticks then. They're stored in 29 days. Wow, so you actually run out of stuff. Oh, and it's raining. 
Am I not getting rained on under the trees? I'm curious. Oh, my campfire is not going to light though, huh? No chance of success because it's raining. All right, so we really need to find those Lanya Lianas ropes off of the jungle trees, right? Maybe this big guy will have one. We gotta be careful because that thing was hunting us around here. Got him. A short-eared dog. I hear another one. Oh, thank God. Got two short-eared dogs. We're eating good, brother. Ooh, Jesus Christ. I did not see that guy right there. Yay. He wasn't making any noise. Kind of hard to hear things sneaking up on you in the rain, huh? All right, let's go up here and check out this little obelisk, I guess. Nothing? Just an obelisk. Okay. That was very close. Okay, so I obviously can't carry three dogs on me. Let's get home. We can build a cover now. What? What? It wasn't even looking at me and I stopped right away. It doesn't make any noise. We took a little bit of damage, but we're chilling. Maybe we should just sleep. I don't know. We might wake up sick, but maybe we should just sleep because our energy's low and it's raining. Oh, God. Maybe not. We're absolutely soaked now. The chance we're going to get a cold. Eucalyptus. Bandage with red gum. Hmm. Gum gum want gum gum. I need long sticks, man. That's a snake. None of these things are giving me long sticks? Am I just crazy? Why am I not getting the option to do anything? Here we go. Three long sticks off of this guy. Ow. I cut my hand cutting it up. But we have a bandage. I'm probably just going to put my canopy like right here. We just need a couple more long sticks, unfortunately. Uh, this guy, give me one more long stick. Nice. I'm thinking because like that looks like there's like four trees for long sticks right there. We have the, the jungle right there and we have palm stuff right there. So maybe we do something up here. Canopy. Right there. I'm thinking probably just a bed we sleep real quick and then we wake up and make a fire. So this will be our base of operations for now. Need five. Maybe we do just go. Let's go back to the coast and sleep real quick. We'll come right back and set up here. I'm also curious if we could break stuff down and bring it with or pick it up, pack it or something. But for right now, let's not overextend ourselves and have some issue that we can't treat, right? All right. Nappy time. Sleep. Eight hours will get us half our energy back. And it's daytime. Heck yeah. All right. Um, food and water is kind of fine. Let's see. Can we pack this? Ignite back. Add field. No. We can upgrade it with stones to unlock baked cakes and fried eggs. We can also upgrade the bed. We can elevate it off the ground with sticks. Okay. All right, let's get a few more long sticks. Let's get a, a little, little setup under the canopy. I'm not sure if this is going to be like a permanent little spot for us, but it's definitely going to be a base of operations. So we're not going to upgrade anything right away. We're going to start getting a little bit of sun exposure, but we should be overall all right. This is our new base of operations out in the thick of it a little bit more. We need three long sticks, but there is a feral dog holding these sticks hostage. Let's wait for him to get a little closer before we throw, or we'll just do it right... <gasps> oh, no. I missed. I can throw the axe, though. Oh, God. What's the pathing? Path What's this pathing? Path okay. No pathing. We're fine. Come here, you little shit. Come on. Show me what you got. Come here. Oh, no. Oh, God. We good? We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. It's all good. Three long sticks acquired. We can make our little bed. I just need two more fronds. 
Nice. What is this right here? <gasps> Wait. Where does this go? I feel like there's going to be something evil in here. <laughs> I don't like... I didn't grab my spear either. Oh, no. Scorpions. I see those. All right. We'll ignore them for now. All right. So we'll definitely add this to the list of adventures. There's a scorpion right there, too. I could have stepped on a few of these on the way in. Oh, God. That would have been bad. Free stick. Yoink. Another free stick. Yoink. Okay. Oh, we're right next to the cave, which is cool. We could probably live in there if we wanted to. But for right now, this is good enough. I'd like to be outside. All right, so we definitely want to just make a campfire here. Put it in, like, the corner. We can upgrade it if we feel like we want better foods. Add fuel. We got five hours on this bad boy. We're going to ignite it. To roast up some short-eared dog. What's that going to give us? Hello food, nice. Roasted meat. If we get some rocks, we can make the better campfire. We can fry up some eggs from the trees. See, our energy is still crap, so we should eat, drink, just get ourselves situated. No coconuts. Whoops. No coconuts here, though. So how do we get water without coconuts? <gasps> Mucho curious. Okay, let's do the quest, though. We just need regular small sticks. I mean, there's obviously a really high chance of cutting yourself on these things, right? Grab this, and mapping charcoal craft. Boom, quest complete. Draw a resource map. What a great view from here. You'll be able to draw a map of the large area. Okay, so it's climb up the tree, but we already did that. So we got to go back up the cartographer tree real quick. All right. Going up. Hope I don't fall and die. Map, find me. Layer up. Island of Hope. Start the mapping process to find resources. Mapping. Start. It's too dark. <laughs> Goddamn mosquitoes. Get them out of here. I'm just running back to this base. We'll grab some coconuts and then take a big long nap. Back at it again another day, and it's daytime, so we can go ahead and scoot ourselves up the tree to map the area. Three hours of mapping later, and boop. We know where there's short-eared dogs, eucalyptus, peccary, boar, hibiscus, tobacco, crabs, coconuts. This is where I ran out of exploring. We gotta be careful of those boar. Date palm. Okay. We have to go to this tree there to uh, to see, like, farther beyond. Find the pictured grotto. Linked document. Grotto location map. S to view the document. I found this, right? It's right, right next to my house. I mean, obviously, the whole thing is here is that we're surviving and trying to find the fountain of youth. So we have a goal. We have no fuel available because we stink. But uh, we can upgrade this. So boop, upgrade that for 38 minutes. We can also move it when we upgrade it. I'm going to just so it's not on the edge. One, two, three stones placed. Build. Boop, upgraded. New campfire. Didn't even have to move the thing. So with three long sticks, we can actually make this better too. Let's grab our spear real quick. Maybe we kill a scorpion and see what that gives us. There's my spear. Should be back in the two key. Yep. We're a little overweight. Maybe we look into making a chest of some kind. Okay, we should look into the water collector. Because eventually we don't want to just drink coconuts. And eventually we'll run out of coconuts. Oh, here it is. Coconut flask. Coconut flask is rope and a ripe coconut. Okay, so we'd have to go back down to the coast first. And we just got to jump in here for the quest. Find the pictured grotto. Boop. It's, it's here. I found it. All right, let's go to the other side of this. Maybe that's where it's going to want us to build or something. Just going to be real careful of these scorpions. I'll get my toes tickled. Here's a scorpion right here. Got him. This is a good spot to maybe level up our throwing. Scorpion carcass. New blueprints unlocked. 
There we go. That man's dead. So what did we get for level two throwing? Reduce stamina drain by throwing. Cool. Look at this. There's a map on the wall. There's already a campfire in place. A bunch of sticks on the ground. A piece of jatoba uh, gum. Whatever the heck that is. This little area here. Oh, this is most definitely where we want to build. Get some torches up in here so it's not so dark. It's already got the campfire set up for us. Whoa. Living water. Oh, this is what we needed to drink right here to get rid of our near death. Living water. We'd increase our max health by drinking it. We'll wait, though. To anyone who reads this, I am Juan Ponce de Leon, head of the expedition of studying these islands. I spent a few days investigating this island and leaving a rough map in my notes. I found the ruins and other traces of ancient civilization. This morning I was exploring the Bay of the East and heard a distant cannon fire. I noticed that I forgot my spyglass of the place where I heard the cannon fire. You can look for it. It's going to be a place with many fireflies. If you find it, I recommend you take a good look around. Here's the map that he left. Mark the approximate location of two water sources. Caption says the spyglass remained in the place where fireflies are visible at night. Okay. We can just check this one over. So obviously this is where we build. It is much darker than I'd want it to be, but it's it's a nice building spot. We can cut down the scrap for some small sticks. There's some extra small sticks here. Let's get this thing lit. That's nice. Okay. Cool. So we don't really need like cover in here, right? Because obviously. Um, and we could put water collectors out front. We need to get a portable box to hold some more stuff. We're going to need another bed in here. Um, and then we can start getting the workbenches and like the carpentry and the skin drying and like some of the crazier workbenches. Let's go out here and just see if we can find a crab to eat. Bunch of coconuts out here that I'll just leave. I'm assuming we can harvest bone from this thing. Oh, there's something at it. Ancient hunting drawing. Hunting process depicted here today is crouch and sneak up on animals and it seems that the animals do not hear him. Hunters approach the animals from behind and hide, but this is so cool. Look at this art. they heard me nice dinner what's out here though <gasps> a toidle I hit it right off its shell you see that they're slow as heck though might be able to just poke it to death die turtle Oh, that's dinner. It'd be cool if I could get a shell and make a shield or something. Let's go see what's out on this tip here. Yeah, see this little drawing? Fishing stand. I can just fish right here. <gasps> Look how pretty. Hell yeah. Okay. So that's right outside my base. So if we need food, we can just fish. Let's go back and make a little bit of this meat. Wait, the fireflies that you can see at night. Isn't this what the, the, the prophecy? The prophecy spoke of this. I'll do that later, though. Shout out. I don't have a spear right now. So out the other side, we have even more palm fronds and other things. God, there is so many rabid dogs out here during the night, huh? I guess we'll snuggle on our old base for now. I don't have a bed in the in the cave yet, in the grotto. And I need those wide leaves to make a water collector, which are right next to my old base, unfortunately. Hmm. A crate over here. Maybe there'd be stuff inside of it. We found an apple in the other crate. A loaf of bread. Yum yum. Okay, I'm getting real confused. Where did we find the wide leaves? Can we check somehow? The sort of flat wide plants? Oh! The, the, like the bushes, the bushy ones. These guys, right? No? They're a little bushier. A little more wider leaves, if you will. They were in the middle of the field over here. I wonder if they regrow or not. There was a snake over here we gotta be careful of. Oh! I just panicked and threw my axe in its head. It didn't do enough damage. And now we're poisoned. And we don't have an axe. All right, well, that place is horrible. There's like three. There's like three. God, okay. Uh, crafting. We have the scorpion on us, right? We do. Okay, I can make an anti an anti-venom at home. <laughs> Add fuel. Ignite using Jatoba gum. Crafting. Anti-venom. Fuck. 
Okay, so wide leaves are obviously a problem. A severe lack of wide leaves everywhere. There's nothing else we can break down for wide leaves, men. Not seeing any of the wide leaf plants anywhere. Right here. Boop. There you go. I'm gathering all of these. I don't even care how much energy it takes. This game's excellent. Single player, but excellent. It'd be even better if it was multiplayer. Obviously. I say that about every game, but overall the mechanics of this game are very, very good. It's like Long Dark meets Green Hell, but there's like actually a story to it. And it's like historically, I mean, I wouldn't say historically accurate because we might find the Fountain of Youth and then become invulnerable. But I mean, it's like Ponce de Leon and his ships crash landed on the island looking for it. And like, I, I like that little bit of history mixed in. It's real nice, actually. Okay, we need to make, we have no fuel. Mm, there's sticks in the cave. We'll just go do it in the cave real quick. But it's also pitch black and I'm probably going to step on a scorpion. There's a stick right there. And we don't have to go all the way. I don't want to go all the way because there's no bed in the cave yet. <laughs> boop pop. Make anti-poison. Beep boop. Take anti-poison. Boom. Good. Healing. Poison treatment, health recovery, by the fire. And it's daytime. Shit. We're going to have sleeping through the day, unfortunately. Half the day, at least. And it's raining. Oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, welcome to survival games. All right, let's cook up. Actually, we have no more fuel. Um, hmm, we don't have the water collector yet, but I can possibly make this. We have the wide leaves. I just need three sticks. So we're going to place a water collector outside this cave. Probably just, like, right here, right? Just slap that, that bad boy right there. We don't have a hammer. Stone hammer. Big branch. Can be gathered from some leafy trees. Son of a bitch. We have nothing. Fortunately, I need some long sticks, which... The most convenient long stick location is, you guessed it, on the other side of the cave. God, I want to go right through there, but the freaking wild dog. Let's just see if we can. Did I get bit by a scorpion? I stepped on one. Another man-made, like, stone? Like, stacked stones or something right here? You see this? Obviously reminiscent of an old civilization. We probably have to follow those to find the spyglass, I'm assuming. Just guarding the trees. I can't jump off of this. I'll hurt myself. Oh, God. I'm gonna go to the right instead. Maybe there isn't any over in this direction. No axe. See, the thing is, I don't have a long stick to make an axe. Or we just need a stone for the axe, right? God damn it. We've really been uh, behind since throwing that axe into the head of the uh, the random snake that bit us. <laughs> really messed everything up. And I, I feel like I dropped some stones in... Did I drop them right here or in the cave? I dropped stones somewhere. Okay, cool. Okay, axe reacquired. We take the axe, we get longer sticks, we make the spear. Or we just go bow. We can craft some more rope. That'll help us make a bow when we get three long sticks. We can just stop using the spear and we'll just start using the bow. Regular workbench? Shit. It's just like one thing leads to another, which leads to another, which leads to another, which we need to obviously start with the baseline stuff so I can make one more rope and then get four sticks. And then I can make the workbench, but geez, low who is? It's going to be a lot of work. So we'll continue this next time and uh, I will see you guys tomorrow.